Okay, would you please stand and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance, and then please remain standing for the invocation. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Bless us, Lord, as we gather today for this freeholder meeting. Guide our minds and hearts that we may work together for the good of our community. Help us to be generous in our outlook, courageous in the face of difficulty, and wise in our decisions. Amen. In compliance with the Open Public Meetings Act, this is to announce that adequate notice of this meeting has been provided. Also pursuant to the 2015 bylaws, rules, and regulations of the Board of Chosen Freeholders of the County of Burlington, Time shall be set aside on the agenda for the receipt of public comments. Public comments will be received with respect to agenda items prior to board consideration of resolutions to be adopted. An additional opportunity for public comment will occur later in the meeting. Public comments shall be limited to five minutes per speaker. Unused time may not be transferred to another speaker. Persons may speak once per public comment period. I direct the deputy clerk to enter into the minutes of this meeting as public announcement and the advance written notice of this meeting. Freeholder Balgard. Here. Freeholder Donnelly is absent. Freeholder Gargano. Here. Freeholder Schwartz. Here. And Director O'Brien. Here. Before we begin tonight, I just want to say a few words about the ongoing renovation project. As many of you know, the renovations to this complex are part of a comprehensive courthouse improvement project driven by the need for enhanced security in our modern times. The primary focus of the project is to create a single point of entry and to properly secure a building that has remained virtually unchanged since it was built, first built over 60 years ago. These security upgrades will ensure the safety and well-being not only of our judges and employees but also for the thousands of county residents who come through this complex each month, whether it's to serve for jury duty, uh, to get married by the clerk, or to participate in one of our meetings here. The improvements evident in this boardroom are much more than aesthetic. They will make our meetings more secure and better serve the safety needs of the many other groups that utilize this space throughout the week, including the tax board, the sheriff's department, our Human Resources Department, local utilities, and the U.S. Marshals. I want to thank all those involved for all the hours of hard work that have gone into this project and for the ongoing efforts that ensure the safety of every resident that enters this complex remains our top priority. Thank you. And with that, we'll move on to approval of minutes. Okay, now I'll be looking for approval of the minutes of the regular meeting of June 24th, the regular meeting of July 8th, and the conference meeting of June 24th, 2015. Motion by? So moved. Second. Freeholder Gargano, second by Freeholder Belgard. Any questions? Additions? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? The minutes are approved. Next, we'll uh, move on to the public hearing. For item G, um, would the clerk of the board please read the ordinance? Yes, this is a public hearing on ordinance number 2015-00336 of the County of Burlington, New Jersey, canceling certain funded and unfunded appropriation balances heretofore provided for various general capital and utility capital projects totaling $8,549,603.09. Okay, uh, we will now entertain public comment on this item. Um, okay, uh, do I have a motion? Director, be a motion to open the public hearing. So moved. Okay, we'll now move on the public hearing uh, for item G, okay? So uh, we have a motion. A motion a motion a second. by Freeholder Gargano. Second? Second. By Freeholder Belgard. All in favor. 
Okay, all in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Any abstentions? Okay, ayes have it. Okay, now we'll move for public comment. Yes. Is there any public comment? No. Yes. Okay. All right, seeing none, I'll close the public portion uh, of the comments uh, and make a motion to adopt. Do I have a second? Second. Okay, motion by Brian, second by Pre-Order Belgard. Roll call, please. <coughs> Freeholder Balfour? Yes. Freeholder Gargano? Yes. Freeholder Schwartz? Yes. And Director O'Brien? Yes. <coughs> now we'll move on to uh, public comment on agenda items. Is there anyone on the list? There's no one there. Okay. All right, since there is no one, is there anyone that is here that has not signed in that would like to comment? Um, since there are none, I will move on to our resolutions. I'd like to make a motion uh, that we approve res resolutions I-1 through I-18 by unanimous consent. Second. Uh, motion by O'Brien, second by Bill Schwartz. Any questions? I have a couple. Okay. Um, so on resolution I-1, I have a couple of questions on the bills. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready for all Okay. Uh, page three, Adam, Raymond, and Hagen. There is a bill for $2,895 for engineer design. Can you tell me what that's for? Uh, Freeholder, that's for work done on uh, Bridge Fork Land Road and Penn Creek. Okay. Uh, I can't remember the other one. I think it's page 28, Camden <laughs> County College. I need to recuse myself uh, from that. Uh, did you, by chance, bring the legal bills for me? I did. Great. Um, then moving right along, page 110, Taylor, Wiseman, and Taylor. There's a bill for $4,442.50. Can you tell me what that is? Oh, this is, this is the engineering on the uh, center and road bridge inspection. Oh, okay. Page 139, Woodard and Karen, $3,752.50 uh, for development, parks, preservation. What, what is that for? What are we, this is uh, for resource commons. This is for the um, Crystal Lake Park development. And then finally, on page 141, uh, the YMCA, I need to recuse myself from that. That's all that I have on number one. I did have a question on I-10. I know that we have conferences with regard to um, the agreement with the uh, mail and services with the courts. We got that all worked out to our satisfaction? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. No changes. No changes to it? My next question is on I-11. I was just wondering what exactly this is. <laughs> Freeholder, I can help with that. Um, and you'll recall that we had an application that went to the state for 5311 Rural Transportation Funding. Part of that included funds to be able to add additional funds to our software, our routing and scheduling software oh, right. project. Okay. And this is where we had a, a partnership with several groups, and, and one of them hasn't been able to really see it's part of that partnership through, so they've dropped out. So we are going to run this, the routing and scheduling software for Burlington County buses alone. And this will allow us to extend the agreement and to add the additional services and equipment to do that. Okay, great. Those are all of the questions that I have on I 1 through 18. Any other questions? I will be abstaining on the bills, page 82, New Jersey Carpenters Funds. Okay. Hearing no other uh, questions or comments, uh, all in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? And abstentions as noted. Thank you. We'll move on to Freeholder Gargano. I can make a motion that we approve items I-19 through I-53 by unanimous consent. 
Motion by Freeholder Gargano, second by second. Freeholder Belgard. Any questions? Hearing none, all in favor? Aye. Uh, Opposed? <coughs> Abstentions? Nice happen. <coughs> Relatively speaking, um, it, was a, it was a pretty quick process, I think, to, to move us uh, back in here. So thanks to all involved with that. Um, I also did want to just thank everybody who put so much hard work and effort into this year's farm fair. It was, once again, a, a great success. I was actually out there every single day of farm fair this year, tossing skillets. And uh, I feel like I've really made it a farm fair and having tossed uh, a skillet or two, which was very fun. <laughs> I highly recommend it in the future. but. Really great job. Um, you know, the, the folks that came through that I had an opportunity to speak to just uh, really appreciate the, the opportunity to, uh, to to come out to it at the county. And, um, and you know, it's, it's really nice, especially to see the young folks who might not otherwise be exposed to, um, you know, some of the, the agricultural life that we have here in Burlington County to, to be exposed to it at Farm Fair. So once again, great job, everybody. Shorts. Yes, I wanted to thank publicly thank um, John Drinker for hosting Amy and I on a tour. It was great, and um, we have a new piece of equipment. The I'm going to say gas whatever the spectro. Could you pronounce it? Spectro blah blah blah. That lets us see all the. You can't I'm say not sure I can pronounce it also, but it's in the forensic lab. <laughs> and it analyzes many samples at one time. Right, and it was very very impressive, and it's a piece of equipment that. Um, was well spent. I just wanted to comment because lots of times the public doesn't know exactly what we're spending our money on or what happens to it. And I know we have talked about that at the meetings and approved it. And it was nice to see that it is um, not only a great thing, but it's also helping us with law enforcement because it's analyzing all the samples that come in for. And there's a lot of shells and shells of things of evidence that go to court. So it was really great to see that piece of equipment. Um, and also the call center. The staff seem to be uh, very happy. I understand that, just for you, those of you who may not know, um, Mr. Drinker has a special recipe for pulled pork, and he hosted a, how many pounds did you bring in for your staff? 80 pounds. 80 pounds, and he personally made it and brought it to his staff, so thank you very much. Um, and then finally, <coughs> again, these accommodations are fabulous, but we still need to take the freeholder meetings on the road. Thank you. I would also like to especially thank everyone who um, spent so much, uh, so many hours um, in, in all the planning and uh, execution of uh, this terrific um, freeholder boardroom. I think it will very much uh, enhance the ability of our public uh, to come and participate in our meetings. And I uh, just really want to give you a special round of applause. Thank you. Okay, with that, uh, I'll take a motion uh, to adjourn. Mm -hmm. Motion by Freeholder Schwartz. Second by Second. Freeholder Belgard. All in favor? Opposed? I have it. <laughs>